isn't it? Is this all you can find? Yes, sir. These were the only guards that were on station. This sorry bunch of Girl Scouts is all I have to send? Ah! The hell with it! It's not like it really matters. Listen up! I want you all to make your way to the transporter room. There, I will teleport you to the position of Steve and Carlos. When there, I want you to shoot on sight. I want you back here within the hour. Is this understood? Sir, sir yes, sir. sir. Good. Now clear off the lot of you. Um, sir? What is it? Would you happen to know what time lunch would be, sir? If anybody else has any questions, you'll be joining your late friend in hell. I just don't get it. We were on an island 20 minutes ago. Now we're in some sort of ice mine miles from anywhere. It just doesn't add up. I think I get it. Would you care to elaborate on that, Steve? Okay, look. We're on an island, correct? Yes. No. What? See? Don't you get it? No. We said to ourselves for the last three years that we were on an island. Well, where's the proof? Until now, we haven't actually explored the so-called island. And now that we have, it is clear to me now that all along we weren't actually on an island, we were merely thinking that we were. It's all just an elaborate plan to trick us into thinking we were. And the culprit behind it all is Van Dyke, who is secretly watching us through CCTV and at this moment is probably sending an army to kill us right now. That is the most far-fetched story I've ever heard. Come on, Steve, get real. This isn't a movie or some sort of TV series. This is real life. Now let's keep moving and stop with the fairy tale nonsense. Well, I was just being proactive. Listen, if you want to be proactive, go make me a sandwich. <sighs> wow. That was one heck of a climb. It was until now I actually realized how badly out of shape I am. Sir, are you seeing this? Yes, Hero, I saw it. Who was that guy? I don't know, but he didn't seem too friendly. He just saved my life, and you're saying he doesn't seem too friendly. What are you, high? Just get on with the mission. Fine. Zero out. <laughs> God damn, this place is creepy. Don't you ever stop complaining. Also, I wish I'd brought the rocket launcher. Why? In case we get attacked. Steve, for the last time, there is no one, I repeat, no one else but us here. There they are. Get them. I told you so. Okay, fine. But this is the only time you're right. Shut up and start running. It's a good 
Accepting these conveniently placed crates were here. Everything happens for a reason, Carlos. There you go again with that conspiracy theory bullshit. Shut up and start shooting. That's always your answer. Hey, hurry up and get over here. This thing is fucking heavy, dude. I'd like to see you carry around a two cubic ton turret. It ain't easy. This is absolutely ridiculous. What do they want? Well, to kill us, obviously. Yeah, but why? Why do you think? No one is watching us. You're just being paranoid. What makes you think they're watching us? It's just a feeling I have. A feeling? Steve, I have a feeling we're gonna die in a moment, so do you think we should do something about that instead of arguing about your stupid theories? Got an idea. Steve? Yes, Carlos? That was amazing! What? Yeah, the way you threw that grenade, you blew them all up! Wow, I never expected you to say this. I thought it was going to get criticized. But you do realize, however, that you are untrained with a grenade and using it could have killed us. There it is. And also that making that shot was a 1 in 100 chance, so you were an utter fool for doing it. Gee, thanks. But you did save us, so I'm happy. Wish I hadn't. Those idiots! How were they overpowered by a couple of untrained buffoons? Where do you think you're going? Uh, nowhere, sir. I just thought you might like to be alone. Oh, really? No, wait! You're right! I do want to be alone! <laughs> That's what you get for sending me garbage! Never send a lackey to do an evil genius's job. I'll find some guards worthy of my time. That is it, Zero. Just in that room. Wait, seriously? This is the place? That seems to be where the signal is coming from. Yes. I thought they said they were stranded on an island. This is no island. Could be a trap. Don't say that. That it could. But who by? What even is this place? There's guards all over the place, but there doesn't appear to be anyone in charge. I, uh, I have to go somewhere. Ralph, hold the fort while I'm gone. But General, sir, where are you going? I just got shit to do is all. Let me know when Zero is on his way back. Ralph, speak to me, buddy. What am I looking at here? If I'm not too much mistaken, it looks like a computer. Oh, no, really? I thought it was a giant refrigerator. I'd say what you're looking at seems to be running a simulated program. For what purpose, I'm not sure. Simulated? Freeze! Don't move! Well, at least it's less creepy in here. Yeah, but look at it. It's not exactly the most welcoming of places. True, but I'd rather this than the other place. So, where to now? I want to check out that building over there. Why? Why the f*** not? Fair enough.
Steve? Are you starting to see a pattern here? What do you mean? Well, first of all, we're supposedly on an island that is always hot. And next, we end up in an ice mine which is as cold as shit. Then we end up in a freaky catacomb kind of place. And now it looks like we're in the middle of a war. I wouldn't really call that a pattern, Steve. It's just a random bunch of places we ended up in. It was a pattern that didn't make sense. How can all four of these places be near each other? That's like putting the Sahara Desert next to Antarctica. You do have a point. That is rather strange now you mention it. So, have you got any ideas? Nope. I'm flat out of ideas. Carlos, you're about as useful as a one-armed trapeze artist with an itchy ass. And you're about as much use as a one-legged man in an ass-kicking competition. Touché. Now can we get a move on while we're still young? Carlos? What is it, Steve? I just want to say, you made the right choice in coming here. I sometimes find it hard to believe how we became friends. I f***ing knew it! What? Look! A security camera! What about it? Van Dyke is watching us this very second! That's probably just part of whatever this place is. It had to belong to someone at some point, but as we can see, it's abandoned. I'm telling you, he's watching us. And I'm telling you, he isn't. Then why were those guards after us earlier? I don't know, but what you're suggesting is complete paranoia. I'm telling you, it's connected. The guards and this camera are way too suspicious to not be part of Van Dyke's corporation. Look, let's keep moving. Clearly there's nothing here. A and stop with all this Van Dyke nonsense! I said, put your hands up. That's it. Nice and slow. No. You! <laughs> yes, me! I've been expecting you, Agent Zero. Wh what? Oh yes, it was all a part of the plan. What plan? The plan to get you here. There is no plan. I was sent here by General Katan. He has nothing to do with you. Oh really? And you're so sure of that, are you? Okay, you need to start explaining. You're not making any sense. I made a deal. A deal that would bring you here to me. Your general sent you here because I told him to.
For more Halo Machinimas and other assortments of gameplay related content, give that subscribe button a bit of a smack on the bottom. Also, don't forget to favourite, like and share. It really helps guys.